Hey guys, your inner chakras. Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you are new, you are welcome. All right, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe if you haven't already, guys. And don't forget to hit the bell to get notified. All right, guys. We're starting with feelings and emotions from a caring man. So how's your person thinking or feeling about you right now? Hmm. I will be loyal to you. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Mm -hmm. They want to massage your feet after you take your heels off or your shoes off. Oh, oh, this one here, they kind of, they <laughs> kind of happy here. I am really blessed to have you in my life. And you fit perfectly in my arms. Mm. So this person wants to be loyal to you. They want to massage your feet. They will be blessed to have you in their lives and you fit perfectly in their arms. If you're currently with your person, they will be loyal to you. They want to massage your feet and they're blessed to have you and you fit perfectly in their arms. All right, guys, let's go. Hmm. Handshake. This is a meeting with a stranger. Could be important. So for some of you, you may be meeting this person. It may be a new person who's going to be loyal. For others, we have a spirit here, guys. There's going to be heartache over what you no longer have. So there may be an ending somewhere somehow. Something could have happened in June. Your birthday could be in June. This person's birthday could be in June. You may meet this person in June. I know that seems so far off, but June... And we have these two. Wow, you got another month here. And then October. Maybe something could have in October. Maybe your birthday's October. There's the person that you're going to meet. That takes it even further down the year, right? And you're like, come on, I know. I know. It's energy. And then someone is behaving stupidly. All right, guys, so something could be happening in June or October. Or those could be birth, birthday months. Um, this loyal person could be a meeting. It's a meeting with a stranger. It's someone new, and then there will be heartache over something that you no longer have. Someone's going to be doing something stupid, something they shouldn't be doing. Holy Spirit. Mm. Oh, it looks like when you meet this stranger... It's going to put you up in your head. I think you're going to have a decision to make, guys. It's like you're going to meet the stranger. I don't know where this person is going to be important to you. And then you have the world card, which means you may leave something because you immediately have heartache over something you no longer have. And then you're the queen of swords. So you're very decisive. And you know what you want. So this may happen in the month of June, right? And it may take you until October to heal. And then walking away. So someone's behaving stupidly. So I don't know when this is going to happen, but it's going to happen. Holy Spirit. But you're definitely making a decision to leave a world or to begin a new world, right? You're making this decision. You could have been having a hard time manifesting with this person. You possibly may find out about some infidelity about another person. This empress in reverse. And I think that is what's going to set you on fire to go forward. Because you're the queen of swords. You're going to find out about another woman. And you're immediately going to go forward. Because you're healing. Too many people are involved here. With this five of wands. It's too many people are involved. Too many people got stuff to say. And you're just going to move on. You're the eight of cups. Uh, you're, you're the queen of cups. And the eight of cups energy. So you're definitely going to move on. To someone loyal. Holy Spirit. It may happen by June. Yeah, you could manifest with this person because you jumped into a connection really fast, possibly without thinking, but now you're seeing everything clearly. Yeah, 
there's no victory. There's no victory in this connection here. This person with this five of wands here, they had a lot of options. Everything that glitter wasn't gold for them, but they had options. But you're standing up to this person. You're standing in their strength. So something's going to happen. Someone's going to behave stupidly. And then I think you're you're going to let it go. Holy Spirit, come collect it. The person that you walk away from is going to try to come back to you. But when they do try to come back, I don't think you're going to have the love to give to them anymore. You may be in a connection when they try to come back to where you can't even give to them. You're going to pull your energy back. Mm -hmm. That situation will be unbalanced, guys, if you go back. I think you know that. Holy Spirit. Yeah, you're just going to keep working, busy working. Or this person is going to try to convince you that they want to make it work. But you you know there's no victory there. You're moving forward. You want stability, something this person can't offer you guys. You possibly have a new lover here. You're walking away. It's not a pentacle in reverse. This person has somebody. You're single now. You're the nine of pentacles in reverse. They wanted to be single. They're single. Holy Spirit. Let's put some shush on this. Holy Spirit. What's collective? I never want us to be over. Isn't that some? These cards are a mess. Holy Spirit. I have more children that I didn't tell you about. So this person had children. They don't want things to be over with you all. And small forward, you were their second choice. Mm. All right, guys. So this is that. Let me send you away <laughs> with the moonology just to, you know, back it up. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, for the collective. I just saw a new moon in Scorpio. And what's crazy is, isn't Scorpio? Yep, here we go. I'm going to take it. We got... New moon in Scorpio, so you need to go deeper. But what's crazy about this is we have that month of October. So in the month of October, guys, you may need to go a little deeper. You may find out some things. That's probably where you may find out about the situation. And then right next to it, it has take a breather. And then it's the last quarter moon in Cancer. And you know, Cancer and June are right next to each other, June and July. So that could be a Cancer moon, you know. So take a breather, guys. It may hit the fan in June, but come October, you're going to go a little deeper and you're probably going to release this, right? You may release this. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, clarify this take a breather. Clarify take a breather, right? Let's just see what we get. It's take a breather because you think everything will not be fine because it's in reverse and spirit is telling you that it will. Everything will be fine. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Clarify, go deeper. Yeah, you're going to end the connection. The higher in reverse. You're going to go deeper and you're going to end this connection. Guys, it may happen in October, but the problems may start in June. And there's the tower. You're going to get through it, though. You're going to get through it. You're bored with what they was offering you. And you're the star. Spirit wants you to know that you're the star. And that whoever you was dealing with is a liar. They're liars. King of Wands in reverse. Person's a liar. But you're changing. You've changed. Yeah, this person's a liar. King Knight of Wands is on the bottom. You're going to move forward fast. Good for you. So your person started out saying they will be loyal to you. But it ended up being a lie. So your person's probably running around telling you how loyal they are. When in reality, 
they're lying. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Peace.